Okay, my walkway friends. I just want to clarify something um, to what I've been seeing on the um, Facebook page um, from WA or C Foresight. Um, WA is um, Gomez. Um, you all, we're not all broad people. We're not Republican. Trump wasn't a Republican before he ran for president or ran for New York State governor. As a joke for both of them, but ended up being our president anyway. But you all have to understand, we're not all Republicans. Never will. Don't think everybody who's in the Republican is white or Republican. You're missing the point about the group thing. Some of us are Democrats, conservative Democrats, who once, well, we are Reagan and Kennedy conservative Democrats, but we walked away from Democrats because of what's been happening since 2000s. They've been picking way more liberal um, Democrats now than ever. And the Republicans are rhinos. You obviously have not been focusing on group posts or people saying about um, like John McCain and Marco Rubio, um, Ted Cruz. They're all like rhinos people. They don't look after what real Americans want. That's what Trump, like, why Trump won present, presidency. Because of um, people who are Bernie Sanders fans and it was furious that the Democrats stole the election to the Queen Bee, bitch. <laughs> and then Republicans who were tired and sick and tired of the establishment telling us who to vote for and what to vote for and why. None of it, them really focus on what real Americans are and what real Americans need. Trump did that. Trump is the number one guy who you should look at for being the next congressman, senator, and who you vote for in November, and also state level stuff. Because right now in New York State, I may have to vote for governor again because the Republican one may one of is not exactly a Trumpican. He doesn't support Trump. He hasn't said he support Trump, and also he has no chance. He, his poll numbers are lower than Cynthia Nixon's. And Cynthia Nixon, red sister. There's no way I would vote for the resistor. I'm not for legal immigration or um, non-vetting um, refugees. I'm for what Trump is and Trump stands for. And then Andrew Cuomo, yeah, he turned into more like his father since his running mate, my friend, Bob Duffy, walked away 60 years ago. Never like Kathy Hogo. So, but I might just have to vote them too because I didn't, I would rather vote for a devil than a resistor and somebody who has no chance and who is not for Trump. And then there is people who are in the Green Party and Green Pieces. Ridiculous. <laughs> but like I said, if they're not for Trump policies, not for what we want, and not listening to real Americans like Trump is, they're not going to get a vote. So stop telling us to vote red or blue or whoever's running, whoever you want. We're voting for a conscious and voting for values. In November, I'm voting for Joe Morali too, because Joe Morali hate to tell you all this, but Louis Sardot, I have a feeling, was a Trump fan. And Joe Morali was that count. 
home. So it's not going to be a white wave. It's not going to be a blue wave. It's going to be a trumpeting wave. Wake up. <laughs>